everyone welcome to dress my craft this is design team member jayshree this side today i am sharing with you all a process tutorial on how to make a christmas wreath using foliage ties from dress my craft but before we dive into the tutorial please do subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and hit the bell icon to stay updated with our latest videos to begin with i am using an embroidery hoop as my base and covering it with white gesso next i am taking some light texture paste and mixing some frosted sugar powder from dress my craft in it to make for snow adding it on the embroidery hoop randomly to give the snow effect how it looks once completely dried now using the foliage and leaves die set number 13 i have die cut out some leaves to make the wreath i have also used the poinsettia die set from dress my craft to make some flowers from the soft floral oriental paper i have colored the leaves using different distress inks and oxide sprays i have also used a poppy red impasto paint to color the red berries on the leaves now i am simply arranging the leaves on the embroidery hoop giving it a shape of a wreath while i arrange the leaves and flowers why don't you give this video a thumbs up if you are enjoying watching this tutorial also the list of all the products is given in the description box below so do check that out now to add this crystallized look to my flowers i am again using the frosted sugar powder from dress my craft i am simply brushing some glue on the tips of the poinsettia flowers i made and then dipping them in the jar and here the flower with four frost on it is ready i am going to repeat the same process for all the remaining flowers as well Now moving on I am adhering all the die cut leaves and flowers in their places using hot glue
Once done that, I am also adhering some red cherry pollens to add some more damage. Lastly, for a little more added texture and for snow effect, I am adding some more frosted sugar powder mixed with light texture paste randomly on the leaves and red cherries. I am not applying this on the flowers as we have already added the frost effect on them. Christmas wreath is ready in no time. Hope you enjoyed this quick tutorial and are ready to create your own and adorn the doors of your homes with them. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel before you go. Until next time, happy crafting. Bye bye.